What's up, YouTube fan? I'm back with a quick video. I'm gonna make another video later on tonight with the van that I just got painted. Look, this is a plain Dodge Caravan. I just wanted to show y'all, you know, it's real simple with this stuff, man. Don't make this stuff complex if you're doing child transportation, you know. Uh, but anyway, I just wanted to just drop what I'm doing right now because I'm actually in the business right now. That Dodge Caravan and that 15 Passenger is maxed out to capacity right now. We probably can drop some kids off and run back to another school and pick up some more kids. But overall, we are maxed out with those two vehicles. And so now we're bringing another vehicle in, a 15 passenger. And I'm just going to share with you how we sh how we going to make a quick $2,000 a month child business. We can do more than that. But on a low end, two grand, it probably be anywhere between two grand and 2,500. So... This is not nothing you can leave a job with, you know, but if you can make it work with the child transportation, it's just some extra money you can have coming in. And that's how you gotta look at it. If you're not doing the work, and you can possibly bring an extra two grand a month and not working, not really doing it, then, then do it by all means. I mean, it's, you, you can't just quit your job all the time. You know, so this right here just going over, it's going to increase our overall business revenue. But anyway, let me get to it. So we got a school down here. We're not going to charge these people as much money because we want to give back. Or we want to help out. We want to help parents out. We know in this area, the parents don't make as much money. So just say we're going to keep all the numbers even. Just say $10 a head. 14, 14 kids. And when you're doing this, you got to lock these parents in for a certain amount of time. Because this is the only way you're going to make money. You got to put that in that contract somehow you gotta lock them in now, i understand it's covid so sometimes that's different you know if that happened okay you can't whatever you know you can't you don't have no control over that but we're gonna do a hundred dollars round trip that's ten dollars a day ten dollars one way ten dollars one way coming home a hundred dollars a day fourteen hundred you know that's fourteen hundred a week 14 kids. We got to have at least 12 to 14 kids. You got to fill a van, you know, but we charge $10. So, bam, $1,400 a week, 200 on gas. That's on a high end. You know, you got to have, and then most of these kids within a three-mile radius of the school. If they outside that radius, then you're going to have to charge more. But anyway, so, 200 off the top, gone in that. Bam. You left with 1200 right? You got Ten dollars a day for gas. It's on say hundred dollars a week. Uh, not gas insurance. A hundred dollars a week for your insurance. Boom, that's three hundred. They're gonna drive you down to eleven hundred. Say you pay a driver three hundred a week just to do that one route for you. You charge. You pay them three hundred a week. Probably pay them two fifty, but we just gonna say three hundred. Bam. So that's two, three, plus another three. That's six out of fourteen. Right. That's gonna leave you with eight hundred dollars a week left over. Then you might take $100 to put back into uh, business expenses or whatever for that vehicle. Boom. You know, that's going to leave you with 700 That's going to leave you with 700 a week right there. That's 7 14 21 28 That's $2,800 a month now that you got coming in your business. Or if you're not working, that's an extra $700 a week that you got coming in. And you're not driving. You're not doing any of that. So that's how I'm making. A, I'm about to make an extra seven hundred dollars a week, extra twenty eight hundred dollars a month in my business with this one vehicle and this one area. Right, really dealing with one school, to be honest with you. It's really one school. But say if I I drop it down and I charge the parent nine dollars, I don't know what the number gonna be if I did nine dollars. But I mean, even if I made four hundred dollars a week, four to five hundred dollars a week, just to look out for these parents. You know what I mean? That's still an extra two grand a month that's coming in. I'm fine. I ain't driving. I, I just made an extra two two grand a month. You know, that can pay my mortgage. If I want to go buy a, 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 a $400,000 house, or something, I'm just, you know, extra two grand a month towards my mortgage now. Now all I got to do is come up with the other part. You know, I'm just, I'm just saying so it's easy to add on to your business. You know, or if you do it like that, just pay somebody, man. You know, that way you ain't got to fool with that stuff. It's easy to grow your business if you ain't trying to be in your business. And you'll get used to not making all the money, you know. 
But I won't be making all that money. I'm just saying, y'all get what I'm saying. Of course, I'm not going to take the $500 a week and put it in my pocket. The money going to go in the business account. But if I wanted to, I could. I'm going to continue to build with the business. I'm not going to touch that money. I pay myself an overall percentage of whatever the business brings in. And I take that off the top once a month. I pay myself a check. You know. So y'all be blessed. But I'm just sharing with y'all how that fast. Those two vans filled up. That fast. We added another 15 passenger to make an extra $2,800 a month in profit. The business going to make that. An extra $2,800 a month. So y'all be blessed. i catch you on the next one. I got a video coming with that van later on tonight when I get back in.